Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. It's been about a week um, since the last video and I'd like to stay on that one week schedule. So we're gonna we're gonna edit this video today right after I'm done recording this. I'm gonna go edit it and we'll, uh, we'll get it out for you guys. The audio should sound different. I went back to my old mixing equipment because I just, I find it sounds so much better and it's less distorted at high volumes. But if you might notice, the music is a little louder as well as just the rest of Roblox. You know, something I thought was really cool is that I, I figured out how to get a drop shadow below the camera in OBS, so it kind of looks like it's popping off the screen, which is pretty cool. So guys, the last time I was on, I managed to get the Life 17. I've been trying to just grind up Reborn items and stuff, but I think today we're going to try to get an Overlord device. Alright, y'all. We're going to send these ores through. We're going to do... We're going to do a couple of Rebirths, and then we'll, we'll probably start. Perfect. I mean, I'll take it, but like... It's not great. I've had a lot of fun playing this game again lately, being on a new slot. I think there's something about this game, particularly in the early game, that's just so fun, though. I think the gameplay just holds up so much better, and most of the problems that come with, for instance, the gameplay loop and stuff, a lot of those problems just don't exist. All right, well, I think we have a decent amount of items, and I think I'd like to do some some, some grind in here. We're going to see how little we could do in order to get what it is we're looking for. I think what's next is going to be our teleporters. And we're just going to let some of these ores loop for a little while. We'll do a full set of 250 ores. Okay, so here's what we have so far. Right now, I have the BBB loop done, the Big Bad Blaster loop, and we have all of the ores looping. However, I'd like, if possible, um, I'd like, if possible, to build the actual setup really quick, which we're gonna do right over here. We'll just use a, a, a teleporter that we already have placed down. And then we're gonna put two of these executive pillars all right this should be able to make dd i'd be very surprised if it didn't all right, I could use Vortex Chamber, but I'm going to be lazy. Okay, so we're going to send all of these ores in first, though. Um, I need to get a Freon down. And we put a ladder here, just so that way we get the extra stud of safety. I don't know if it'll do much, though. All right, we're going to put these in now. Okay, uh, let's hope that this works. We don't need any crazy um, values, I'm assuming. Oh shit, I've just like had all these ores just going straight in. God damn it. All right, they're like all QNs and stuff. It seems like all we have left are pretty much good ores, which is good. I'm glad all the crappy ores died. Now it's just a matter of like, let's hope this works. All right, I'd say once we get an SP ore, I think I'm gonna run it through the setup because I think, I think it could probably get enough through most of these items here. I think we'll throw in a couple more items. I think we'll throw in four of these. Uh, I don't know if I care enough for any of the other ones. Alright, I just kind of like want to like evaluate all these ores. Alright, we have a high SP. It could be an octillion, so we're just going to run it through really quick. Oh, I actually think I crushed this. I was worried that maybe I'd be undershooting a bit, but nah. Like, I feel, I feel like we... We got this. Bro. You know, I've been thinking a lot about some of the old challenges in Miner's Haven lately, especially working on Time Machine as you know, much as we have. And one of the things I've really thought about is how awesome and how good all of the rollouts are for every single challenge launch throughout the years. I mean, we first had the Duo Decillion challenge back in 2015. That was pretty good. Um, I don't know if it really 
was much of a challenge. I think it was for a lot of casual players, but I think all the hardcore players had pretty much dominated it at that point. Uh, but I remember Centillion being very hard for most people, actually, like like 90%, 99 even. I actually don't know about 99, but it, it was very difficult. And another really good one was TSTG. I mean, like, I feel like it's still such an iconic challenge. It may not be the hardest challenge this game has anymore, but it's just so fun. And it always feels very just cool to do. You know, I'm kind of curious to see it. I want you guys to leave a comment um, or include it in your comment if you're already going to, but leave a comment and I'd like you to tell me what your favorite part about the minor save and challenges are. So like Duo Decillion, so like Overlord, uh, True Overlord, Centillion, stuff like that. Okay, once we get an Anillion Ore, I think we're good. I think we do though, unless it died. It died. Um... Well, I think our setup is strong enough anyways at this point, so I think I'm just going to run it. And then, um... We will... Implement the Overlord into our Rebirth setup. Because I'd really, really like to get a, a pop in Rebirth setup. And just, that additional 10 times is going to help so much. Let's load this in. And then, uh, if I have to replace something, I will, but hopefully not. Let's actually resave it. Okay, we did it. Because if you guys don't remember in the last video, I did not save my damn setup. I was like sitting there. I was wondering like, how did that kill my setup? Are just advanced scanners so good? Oh, we're so saved. We're so saved, bro. It's, it's GG's. It's, I don't even need to play the game. Well, now that we have like the main items that I feel like we're looking for, for now, I think we're just gonna do some grinding now and just let's just see what items we could get along the way. All right, anything I'm gonna get that's decent, please? Maybe, just maybe. You know what, I'll actually take this. I feel like Big Birth is a pretty decent choice. Like if there's anything that I'm gonna get that's like amongst like the meh mid items, I feel like Big Birth is not like the worst option. I feel like next episode, I think the next step is going to be trying to get rid of the loop so that way we can just have the setup without the loop and just be able to like just load something in hopefully. I feel like that would probably be the best for me, but I don't mind having to get money and like buy shop items, but I think ditching the loop and having like just an automated setup would be pretty cool. Alright, let's see... You know, I don't necessarily need it. I kind of just want to get some good mines. Because once I have a, a decent set of mines, then I don't have to, like... I wouldn't have to get out of my layout screen in order to withdraw all my items and then go back to the layout screen and then spawn in the next layout. It'd be nice to just click, click, and then go withdraw if I have to. Um, so I think I think that's another step that i could take to improve the setup but i think i think either way like we're getting there i'm wondering what the setups are going to look like for non-sac once i get to like the thousands because that's actually something i've never really truthfully played in this game was um you know life whatever thousand at um without sacrificing i've, I've never tried that i'm very interested to see Hopefully if the meta changes a little bit, like it it'd be cool it'd be cool to see some like neat tricks. Not necessarily tricks, but like concepts and stuff used in combos for items and just like I don't know, I I'm really excited to see it though. I I think we'll manage to make a decent setup. At least one that de uh, does a decent amount of skipping. Um doesn't have to be a full 20, but just a way to have some sing uh, some consistent shard, you know, income. And it'd also be really cool to just to have it relatively fast, I'd hope to not have like a 10 minute setup, but if it has to happen, I will. I'll, I'll totally do it. We're gonna rebirth again. A minute and seven? I wonder if I could do sub, sub minute. All right, what crazy item do I get? Cause I know I'm gonna get something good. It happens every time. Okay, I got something decent that I'm kind of surprised I didn't already have to be honest, but not what I'm looking for just yet. Nope. Also, another point that I'd like to bring up um, in regards to this series is that I'm probably going to hold back for the most part. 
for the most part, not entirely, but from using cannons, I don't know, it's just, I feel like this is the only time that I could kind of sit down and um, enjoy the game a bit more casually. I'd say with how relevant cannons are in Endgame though, like, I don't know, I just, I just don't want to use them. Bro, another Tesla, man. I, I mean, like, like, Tesla's good, but, like, I'm not trying to implement Tesla right now. Like, I, like I already said, I, I didn't want to. If I want to use Tesla, I've got to, like, get all the items for it, or loop all the items I have. And then I also, at that point, would just want the whole setup to not have a loop, and I already said I was kind of saving that for, for next video. Right now, I'm trying to get a better mine, so that way those things are possible next video because right now i don't think they are um actually maybe it is to have a a loopless setup now but I i'm not entirely sure and i wouldn't say it's far from i wouldn't say it not being possible is far from uh being accurate but who knows all right i think this is going to be the last rebirth for today because i really want to get this video out today you also got guys you also might be seeing another video from me later this week. Um, I'm hoping to do two videos this week because I've just, like I said, I've been having a lot of fun doing this again. You know, I'll take green tea latte. But yeah, um, hope for a new video this week. It is possible. You can pressure me in the comments about it below if you want. Um, I hope you guys have been enjoying this whole like series returning. It seems like it's been doing pretty well on YouTube and... Uh, I don't know, it just makes me happy that you guys seem to enjoy this stuff. This is the content that I've been enjoying making lately, so it's cool to see the love. Either way, I think that's it for this video. This is going to take a while to... This is going to take a while. This is like an hour and like 20 minutes of footage. Um, but I'll see you guys. Thanks for watching. It was good to see y'all. Peace out. Bye-bye.